so today our topic is tool selection okay so for automation testing purpose we have a lot of tools in market like the major tools we can say uft qtp and selenium so compared to the uft and qtp and selenium so most of the it companies they are selecting the tool is selenium only they are selecting so why people are that much of interest showing on this selenium means because it has a good advantages so here in this lines we can see comparison between the selenium and another tools okay so uh, i am making a selenium as one side and qtp and uft is one side so here is the futures the first future is cost so compared to the qtp and uft selenium is a open source open source means we don't want to pay any single rupee to use this tool so mainly we can say zero cost okay so open source is nothing but a so it is a available freely so coming to that uh, coming to that qtp and uft these both are commercial tool and as well as it had a huge license cost so we need to pay lot of money for this qtp and uft and coming to the second thing browser support so what is the mean by browser support like a uh, chrome firefox that things so selenium supports firefox chrome internet explorer safari opera and etc but coming to the qtp and uft it only supports that firefox chrome and internet explorer and coming to we can say operating system so operating system is nothing but a selenium supports windows mac unix unix is nothing but a linux linux operating system as well but coming to the qtp and uft it will support only windows and languages supports selenium supports java python c sharp ruby perl php javascript etc but uh, it supporting both programming languages and as well as scripting languages also but coming to the qtp and uft it was not supporting for the multiple languages it was supporting only for the vb scripting it is nothing but a one of the scripting language visual based scripting we can say coming to the parallel execution parallel execution means nothing but a same time so same time we need to run in a firefox browser and as well as chrome browser in selenium it was supports the parallel execution coming to the qtp and uft it does not support so there is a no parallel execution yes coming to the remote execution so remote execution is nothing but like uh, we are like uh, following in our so sometimes we are not available to write run the code so we are unable to go to the office so we need to handle in a, where you are following for that purpose remote execution is available in selenium in the grid but coming to the qtp and uft there is a no remote execution concept there is a no remote execution concept now final one hardware utilization so it can support that hardware utilization like uh, extra configurations but uh, it not supports selenium not supports for the hardware utilization but qtp and uft supports there is a one major advantage here but it is not that much of important thing okay based on in our view uh, when coming to the commercial tool so why we are giving the money that much of money for commercial tool means it should be contain some extra features but compared to the commercial tool we can see selenium is a open source but there is a lot of advantages qtp and uft so okay uh, okay guys tell me in your view selenium is better or qtp or uft are better Selenium is better, sir. It is open source okay, and it is a no cost, and yes. it can be run in any browser. Yes, Selenium is better. So why? Because Selenium contains lot of advantages, and it it, uh, it was a open source, like a free tool. But coming to the QTP and UFT, 
we need to pay our money and we need to get the less service from the qtp and uft so there is a like operating systems also there is a less operating system only windows we can run okay so that is the thing now coming to the so okay in this tools selection concept so we are selected selenium is the tool we are selected selenium is the tool